Because one of the most powerful cards of the major arcana, the lovers, is a card of union and harmony that establishes balance and conception. Conception comes into this also. Sun and moon, man and woman, spirit and mortal are united in the ecstasy of creation. So from the most mundane level to the sublime, the symbols in the card of the lovers are the acknowledgement that perfect union starts within the individual and then evolves outward into the cosmos. Man as a separate entity has virtually no ability to spontaneously create. We must surrender to the urge to incorporate our life with another or with divinity in order to embrace and fulfill uh, that desire that, that is inherent within all of us to give birth and, and to bring new things into being. 